Reading from a document which the Edo State chapter, the People's Democratic Party, claimed was the report of the findings and recommendations presented to the state government in November 2012 by the panel on the collapsed building at the Central Hospital in Benin, led by its chairman, architect Paul Ayewe, the Edo State PDP chairman, Chief Dan Obi said there was need to substantiate and clarify the issue of the collapsed structure as a way of proving to the public that the party's criticism was done in good faith. Chief Obi said, based on the recommendation of the panel constituted by the state government, which include members of the Nigerian Society of Engineers, members of the Nigerian Institute of Architecture, members of the Nigerian Institute of Quantity Surveyor, and other affiliated bodies, said in the report that what led to the collapsed building was due to the fact that the contract was allegedly awarded to a quantity surveyor contractor instead of an architectural engineer. Coupled with the fact that there was no resident structural site engineer to supervise the project except for the South African expatriates. He also alleged that the report by the panel showed that the structure has no solid foundation. The report came out clearly to say that the non inclusion of relevant technical professional team to remedy all lapses before and during the period that the contractor took over the site resulting in the collapse of the wing which the panel in their wisdom the wisdom of these professionals they describe that particular complex as a sick complex oh and that the entire complex was described by the panel as sick those who are into the beauty industry will agree with me that once a project is described as sick, that project is, is dead. Chief Dan Obi, while describing the central hospital building that has been reawarded by the state government as a time bomb, urged the state government to demolish the structure in line with the recommendation of the panel. I can even give you copies of the executive summary by the panel where they stated clearly that the government failed in its responsibility in ensuring that this contract was not only awarded to a firm but must be awarded to a firm that was competent to carry out the job but what they did we don't know the process they used in arriving at the contractor but some people feel that the contractor was awarded this job because it's the same contractor that is building his private residence what over 10 billion in Niyamo? Some people feel that this particular project was awarded to the contractor to make up for the money he was using in building his private residence in Niyamo. When somebody is sick, the person needs cure. And the cure for this particular project is to bring the entire complex down so that innocent lives can be saved. The project failed integrity test. The Commissioner for Information, Louis Odion, could not be reached for comment as he was attending the State Executive Council meeting in Government House. Best Mbire reporting.